Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I want to thank each and every one of you for tuning in on this afternoon. It's your host Bridget coming to you live from Houston, Texas. And I just want to pray, say a prayer and I pray that this video is finding you in a very um, blessed and safe state with the pandemic that's going on around globally around the world. I really just send my prayers to you and your family. But, you know, we're going to get through this together. And so I had a little like most Americans, I have time on my hands. So I thought I'd make a quick video. I'm going to make it very quick. Probably won't even be um, four minutes. OK, so I thought I wanted to make a video First of all, if you have not become a subscriber, I would love for you to join the Same for Family. Go ahead and subscribe down below and the little bell notification. Go ahead and smash that button. That way, when I bring a, um, a video to you, you will get the notification. So without further ado, let's just jump right in. I wanted to make a video of my most, um, the fragrance that I get the most compliments on so my best compliment getter i uh, thought i would uh do that one and it is going to be none other than molecule um ambrosian eccentric o2 guys let me tell you every time and you can see this bottle is pretty much gone and i'm gonna have to go ahead and order another one that's good that should tell you how much i i um i just kind of like yeah, I went in on this one. But anyway, it's Ambrosian and Centric O2. Now, they have different um, ones, but this one is the Molecules O2. It was released in 2006. Um, I got this. I bought this about, um, I've had it for a while. I'll ha Every time I wear this fragrance, people literally stop me. They, I don't care where I'm at. They will come and find me. What are you wearing? When you smell, when you spray it, it is very clean. This fragrance, it gives off. Um, it is just a very clean, fresh. Um, it's not citrus. It's just clean. That's just the one word that it gives me. Now, let's go for the notes. It has ambrosian, vetiver, muscone, which is, um, that is more of the technical name term for it, but what it is, is artificial musk. It has orris, elder flower extract, and hedion. And what that, the hedion is a... I guess that's more of the te technical name, but essentially what it is is jasmine, okay? Now, what this is giving me is also giving me an airy vibe. When I wear this, I feel like if I could just use my imagination, I feel like I'm floating. Like when I wear this fragrance, it's very, it's just airy, it's light, it's fresh, it's non-offensive, it's... um. It's, um, uh, it gives you happy vibes. It's, it gives me, um, it makes me feel mysterious when I wear it, but not on the warm side of mystery, on the cooler side of it. So if you guys know about the notes, warm versus cool, this is, this is going to give you the cool vibe. Um, now, I would definitely, I pulled, this is one that I actually pull out in the spring and summer. I don't usually wear this one in the fall and winter because it is a clean fragrance. So, I pulled this one out. I'm actually going to wear this one tomorrow and for the remaining of the weekend. But it's just a really, really nice fragrance. If you do not have this, I encourage you to get this. And again, this one is the O2. They have the O1, but I like the Ambrosian. Um, O2 molecules. It is the bomb. Love, love, love this stuff. Again, like I said, I've had it for a while and I wear it. I don't wear it a lot, but I do wear it a lot when it's time, which is right now, <laughs> the spring. And so, uh, yeah, I will go ahead. I will be ordering uh, another bottle here and probably next week. 
So, um, but that's pretty much all I have. Um, and so that's it. This is my number one attention getter fragrance. This is it. Every time I wear this, people gravitate to me. They stop me. They're running to me. Uh, I noticed when this is before this pandemic, obviously, when I would I was somewhere. I forget. I think I was at a wedding or somewhere and I was embracing someone. And I actually women ask me as, as well as um, guys. And oh, by the way, this is a unisex fragrance. So, yeah, to my men. Yes, you guys can rock this as well. So if you have not tried it, um, go. I don't think they have it at some of the fragrance outlets. At least I haven't seen it. But um, trust me, you will not be disappointed in it. Um, you can try um, to see if you can get a, a tester with it to see if you may not want to invest. Because it could be, it's not really, really pricey, but you know, it's not the cheapest as well. But I, I don't care. I, I would pay for it. I would pay for it. I think I spent like a hundred dollars or something. It's I think it's a little cheaper now. It's a little bit less expensive. I think you can get it for like maybe 80 bucks, something like that. So, and I, this one is the 3.4 mil, 100 mil. So yeah, definitely go ahead and, and go ahead and make that investment. You will not be disappointed. It is just, it's a very, um, it's just a very, very opulent fragrance. So that's pretty much it. So um, you guys take care. And until the next time, until the next time, remember, stay sinful. Bye-bye.